Hello, I'm Megan McLeod, a member of the IIB management team and an immunologist based at the Sir Graham Davies building at the University of Glasgow. In my lab, we are interested in how past infections and insults lead to altered immune responses in the future. We've known for thousands of years that our bodies can be trained to respond more effectively to pathogens we've been exposed to previously. This pathogen specific immunity is mediated by T and B cells. These cells are trained during an infection and can remember the instructions they receive, providing a faster and more effective immune response upon a further exposure to the pathogen. This immunological memory is the foundation for the success of vaccines. While we have vaccines against many pathogens, the protection they offer is mainly mediated by antibodies. Unfortunately, antibodies are not sufficient to protect against a number of infections that cause massive morbidity or mortality across the globe annually. In my lab, we investigate the generation and function of immune memory, asking fundamental questions about the cells and molecules that are required for and involved in secondary immune protection to pathogens. To address these questions, we mainly use a mouse model of influenza virus infection. We are very focused on what's happening in the lung during and following the infection, examining long-term changes to immune and also lung stromal cells. This is because we believe that infection leads to altered communication between all the cells present in the lung, and this altered communication is central to the enhanced response following secondary infection. Currently, there are seven of us in the lab, myself, two postdocs, three PhD students, and a technician. Everyone in their lab has their own particular project, but we often work together, especially in big experiments that require lots of hands to complete. We use a mixture of cellular and molecular techniques to examine lung and immune stromal cells. This includes flow cytometry, imaging, and gene transcription analysis. My lab are integrated with four other immunology groups, and together we are the laboratory of immune cell visualization and examination, or more easily, live. This means that we have lots of knowledge and expertise on tap to help plan and carry out experiments. We often present our research at local, national and international meetings and find some time at meetings that have some fun while we're out of the lab. We also think it's important to talk about our research with the general public. At the moment, we are focusing on a three-year project funded by the Wellcome Trust. In this project, Co-Immunicate, we are working with a local primary school to develop new and fun ways to discuss our work with the community. I'm looking forward to getting to know you all during your PhDs and welcoming you to Glasgow soon.